when you're moving, it's, it's a bit different. Your yeah. foot's there, it can still come up. Okay, I want to try that. I'm going to die, but... The objective is, your foot's already there. You have to get that one to... You can't... You can't it's about time. Yeah, it's almost like... You have to be able to... Like, as you're stepping off, you use the... You have to be able to have your foot there and step off without the board coming up. Because if you're already pushing, it's gonna fly up. You have to have, it's almost a little hop off and then a press. Core. Get on. Yeah, get on. Put your foot on the tail. Mm -hmm. Try to get that guy on the ground without the board coming up. Yeah. Ooh, it's hard. Yeah, I'm gonna stand this way so I don't like go into a car again. Fair enough. <laughs> That's close. Cool. You wanna get you gotta set the set it on the ground without without the board coming up. Yeah, that's how you that's how you maintain maintain control. Yeah. It's hard though. It's it'll come up a little bit. But when you have control over it, it lets you pop it up. Wait, what if I go... Uh, oh, do you yeah, like here, I do. Ready? Put all your weight... Put your foot on the tail. Okay. Now, put all your put all your weight on your front. Okay. But just sort of, like, can you lift up this? And try to just tap it. See how it's really light there? Yeah. Now, bend your front knee and just kind of jump on your left foot and kind of come off. Yeah. Yeah, you see how your foot was on the tail? Your, most of your weight's on your front foot. Yeah, exactly. It's close. I just, I, I, I messed up when I was getting it back into my hand. Yeah. I put too much force in and I basically just stepped on it. Take most of your weight off the back foot. Right. It's there, so it's still there, but most of your weight's on the front foot. Then you just sort of have to hop off and still keep that back foot on. What if I go? That would be cool. I don't know what that was, but that was pretty cool. Just made up his own trick. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> Your shoe's untied. That was actually like half. Shoe's untied. That was almost a slip out. Yeah. Yeah. Roll it, you know. If 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 you're so pressed back, uh -huh. it's not gonna come off because you're already gonna be pressed down. Okay. It's being able to pop off and then pop it up. And then it ends up kind of being at the same time. But the first thing is to get that front foot yeah, like exactly, that? with your foot still on the tail. Okay. So that way when you go to apply the pressure, you're mm -hmm. in control. So it's not really your body weight popping it up, it's like... It's... It's, it's your not, control of the back foot? Yeah, exactly. It's not my... It's, it's totally my back foot. It comes and kind of makes a little walk forward. Okay. Oh, that was super close. That was nice. I think I almost got that one. <laughs> the cars are coming for you. You like doing it with your, your left foot. You're hopping off and you do it with your left foot. Like that's fine. That's yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. But when you're in motion, it's your yeah, right I'm just foot. having trouble with that. Dude, every time I try to do it, when I pop it up it hits me in the shin. Yeah. Oh, so okay. how do I fix that? Alright, try it. You pop it up again. Yeah. Like stepping off and then yeah. Um, and do I just need to push it down more so it doesn't get stuck in that? You actually have to. You have to. You have to push your. Dude, you dropped your paws. Oh.
Yeah, the front shin. Uh, and that's because you're... Uh, that's because your back foot, this this foot is getting stuck on the ground. Okay. You actually end up on this foot. Oh. And that back foot actually just kind of goes up in the air. It's just a flick like that? Yeah, ready? Right? You end up on the front foot. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> you do. You don't, you don't end up on this foot. Right. You end up on this foot. Oh, so I should really focus on yeah. putting that foot so down. You press it. And then it's done. As soon as it pops, it's, as soon as it pops, this foot's done. So the back foot is always light footed. Exactly. And if I do a stretch, you'll see the same thing. Oh. Let me try that. Yeah. All right. That's different than what I thought. Yeah, you end up you end up with your weight on the front foot after you release the board. Whoa. Nice. <laughs> it almost got you in the face, but yeah, it was like right there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you kind of guide it with that back foot. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Uh huh. I kind of. See, now you're in control of it. Yeah. Yeah. Now that it's popping up, you just got to figure out how to control it right. as it pops up. Is it all about the flick or just... It's all, it is about that back foot. I'm sorry, Wyatt. I completely missed it. <laughs> sorry. And I landed on my front foot. 100% of the time when you land something, nobody's going to see it. Yeah. That's a big lesson in skateboarding. I landed it and it landed right like this. Uh-huh. And I kicked it up. That's sick. I'm better at it on other boards. That's that one. Getting away from it. That doesn't even matter, that just looks cool. <laughs> Made it work. <laughs> Ideally, you should be able to do it such that you don't actually scrape the good thing. Huh. Sock tricks? Everything's light, everything's so, so light that your feet don't really scrape on the grip tape when you do it. Hmm. Why are you taking your shoes off? Because your feet don't scrape on the grip tape. Like, yeah. Everything's a press and lift motion. The front one lifts off, the back one just presses down. I mean, down. I can't tell since so 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Most tricks are like that. Doesn't even need skate shoes. Yeah. If you're wearing your feet down... Hey, you mind if we just pick up my, uh, my bag? What? Yeah, where's it at? Uh, feet first. Yeah, go, 